Hello, my name is John Lee and I'm the president of Alpha Training and Consulting. And I have a true passion to prepare students for ASQ certification exams. I love the ASQ certification program. But today we're going to be talking about how do I become an ASQ CQT Certified Quality Technician. It's a wonderful certification. And so step one, get the desire and meet the prerequisites. Candidates must have worked in a full-time paid role. Uh, candidates must have at least four years of higher education and or work experience. So four years work experience is the requirement. However, if you have a certification, uh, a quality technology program or community college or vocational school, one year is waived. So if you have any of those, you only need three years of work experience. Associate degree, two years waived. So if you have an associate degree, you only need two years of work experience. If you have a bachelor's, bachelor's or bachelor's, master's, or doctorate, sorry about that, you have three years waived. In other words, you only need one year experience if you have those higher uh, levels of education. Now, you want to check this out before you go take the test. Make sure nothing's changed. This is uh, the element at the ASQ website that will give you this information. All right, step two, prepare to take the exam. This is the most time-consuming and difficult element of becoming a CQT, ASQ CQT, and uh, I hope you'll consider one of our classes to see the class, uh, learn more about our class for quality technician. You can go to www.asqcqt.com. We've trained, uh, we teach many classes on ASQ certification. We've been doing so for 20 years, and we've been improving them for 20 years, so we have an excellent class for you should you be interested. These are all the lectures we give to prepare you for the ASQ CQT exam and of course we also have the primer that you can read and everything else. Anyway, we have an excellent class. Step three, <clears throat> so now you've met the requirements and uh, you've prepared for the exam, now you're going to sign up for the exam. First of all, watch my video entitled How to Sign Up for an ASQ Exam. It's about a seven minute video but it'll answer all your questions as far as signing up for that exam. Now, the CQT is on the January cycle. What does that mean? Well, ASQ offers the CQT exam all year long, every other month. So it starts with January, skips February, then March, then skips April, and tests on May. So it's every other month starting in January, on the January cycle. And by the time you listen to these, these dates will be worthless. But if you'll remember, every other month you can take the exam and you need to apply about a month before you want to take the exam, hopefully earlier than that. You don't want to put it off to the last minute. There may not be any seats left in the testing center. Uh, you want to check and make sure this is still valid when you go take the test, and this is where you go to get that information. All right, what is the pass rate on the CQT? Well, the CQT, out of 18 certifications, uh, it's at number 11 as the as the easiest pass rate, I guess. So first is easy, 18th is most difficult. So you're in the more, on the more difficult side of the equation when you take the CQT. It's not an easy certification exam. 67% uh, of the people pass it, that take it, generally speaking. Now if you take our class, we're more in the 85-90% range. Okay? And uh, I suggest, if you take our class anyway, you have about 78 hours of prep time to prepare for this, successfully prepare for the CQT exam. All right, step five is one of my favorites. Pass the ASQ exam and celebrate. You know, what a wonderful time there. And there's something to celebrate. Look at the quality technician, the average salary. I looked up all these different websites here on salaries for CQT. Came up with $45,331 on average. That's a pretty good salary, and it's a great certification. It'll help you have a great career. Now, I lecture more on this salary uh, as far as how much education you have, what industry you work in, etc. If you want to listen to that video and get more details on that, you most certainly can. All right, uh, I've passed most of the ASQ certification exams. I've been teaching people how to pass certification exams for over 20 years, so hopefully you'll let me help you. You can contact me through my website, go to the contact us option, send me a message, and I'll get back with you as soon as possible. Thank you, and have a great day. Goodbye.